So we've had a pretty good run. You know, in the last 500,000 years, Homo sapiens have managed to build cities, create complex languages, and put a man on the moon. Yeah, we've made some moves. But it could all be taken away from us just like that. And that's what we're going to be talking about today. Hey YouTube, I'm Court McGinley and welcome back to the most amazing top 5. Before we get started, I want to know what is your favorite thing about our planet Earth? Let me know your answers down in the comments. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you haven't already and give this video a big thumbs up so we can keep bringing you awesome top 5 videos. Alright, let's get started on our list of the top 5 ways Earth could be destroyed. Coming in at our number 5 spot, Death of the Sun. Sadly, this one is definitely going to happen one day. But lucky for us, it's not going to happen in our lifetime. In fact, it's not going to happen for another few billion years. So this one, it's pretty clear cut. As the sun ages, it gets larger. And in about 1.2 billion years, the sun will start to change due to the hydrogen fuel in its core getting used up. This will cause the burning to spread outwards towards the surface. And this will cause the sun to grow bigger faster. Over time, the increase in radiation will have a devastating effect on our planet. At a certain point, Earth's oceans will begin to evaporate and boil away. And the planet as we know it will pretty much just burn up. The Earth's surface temperature will rise from 68 degrees Fahrenheit to 167 degrees Fahrenheit. Yikes. In at number 4, black holes. Now while this one is pretty unlikely, it's still slightly possible. I mean, even though we can't see them, there are an estimated million black holes throughout our galaxy. Currently, the black hole that's assumed to be closest to the planet is 1,600 light years away from Earth. If the Earth is destroyed because of a black hole, it's likely we would only have a few months warning that one was passing through our solar system. We cannot personally see black holes, but we can judge where they are by going off how they affect their surrounding environments. So if this is the way it went down, it's not likely a black hole would gobble up the Earth entirely. Instead, gravity would distribute over the orbit of the planets, asteroids, and even Earth. At number 3, alien attacks. Oh yeah, I'm going there. This list is pretty depressing, so I wanted to put something on it that's not a definite catastrophe. Now some people they think aliens might be nice. You know like E.T. or those little green aliens on Toy Story. But when I think of aliens, I think about the ones on Mars attacks. Yeah, you know the ones who destroy the Earth. Because let's not forget this list is called Top 5 Ways Earth Can Be Destroyed, not Top 5 Cute Little Aliens That We Can Coexist With. World renowned theoretical physicist Dr. Stephen Hawking has his opinions on aliens and says if they were real they would most likely be hostile. And that they would be looking to colonize on Earth or mine our resources. So yeah, basically they would just just chill up in space, send down probes with agents aboard, and just wait until we're all killed off. Coming in at number 2, Major Asteroid Impact. This one is just like it sounds, a huge asteroid coming and impacting Earth. Yeah, it would destroy it. In the past, major asteroids have caused large scale extinctions on Earth. For example, the Chicks Exulub impact that happened 66 million years ago, and that was assumed to cause the mass extinction that wiped out the dinosaurs. Yeah, you know the one that none of us were around for. If a small asteroid were to hit our planet, it wouldn't end life on Earth as we know it, but it would put an end to modern life in whatever country it landed in. A medium sized one would cause a nuclear winter. Which which would kill off a huge percentage of people. But if it's a huge asteroid hit, it would turn the crust of the earth into magma and the earth would be destroyed. But fear not because NASA is confident in their asteroid tracking abilities and say that they would know if a detrimental large asteroid is coming our way. And as we speak, scientists are looking up ways to deflect asteroids away from our planet. And in our number one spot, environmental catastrophes. And this is actually something that's happening right now in the form of pollution, global warming, depletion of natural resources, industrial activity, and agriculture. So eventually us not taking care of our planet will put an end to life on earth. Given the fact that us as humans are really dependent on the ecosystem for food and other natural resources, if all of that disappeared then so do we. So start taking care of the planet guys, reduce, reuse and recycle. And there you have it, that's the list of the top 5 ways the earth could be destroyed. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.